Hey guys, and welcome to my 17 pregnancy update with baby number three. Um, I have not done an update in a while. We did take pictures at 15 weeks. Um, nothing has really changed besides my belly is getting bigger. <laughs> um, so I don't have a whole lot to update on, but I wanted to do an update today. This is a few days after I'm actually 17 weeks, but the belly shot that I will insert at the end was actually taken at exactly 17 weeks. So that is accurate. Um, okay, as far as the baby, the baby is, or actually the baby weighs as much as a turnip, which I don't have one, so <laughs> um, yeah. And I don't know if I have felt the baby or not. I'm pretty sure I have over the weekend. Um, you know, I thought I felt a few little kicks, like way down low, just not kicks, play our kicks, but like little pokes, I guess it feels like. Um, and then maybe the next day I felt kind of the same thing, but the last couple of days I haven't felt anything. So I think it kind of plays with my mind. Am I really feeling the baby? Am I not? I don't know. I want to think it is the baby. <laughs> so I think I'm feeling the baby, but who knows to be sure. As far as myself, I have been tired again. Um, and really, really out of breath. If I like pick up the toys from the boys or um, even just carrying a basket of laundry from one side of the house to the other or picking up Cooper, oh my goodness, I am just out of breath, which that's, it's fine. It's just I'm feeling more exhausted than I was a few weeks ago. So that's probably the biggest thing that's changed. And emotionally, Nothing has changed. I feel great. We're on vacation. We're in Oregon. You can see I'm in a different um, setting than normal. But we're in Oregon for another six-ish weeks, I believe, I think. And um, so yeah, emotionally I'm doing great. I feel very relaxed and it's very peaceful here, so I'm very happy. As far as weight gain, I don't know how much weight I've gained because we left our scale at home and there's not one here. And I don't want to go buy one because I want it to be like, you know, our other one, they can vary from, you know, scale to scale. So I didn't want to go buy one and have it be off. And it doesn't really matter how much weight I'm getting at this point anyways. I've probably gained a couple of pounds, I'm going to guess, but nothing huge. And I measured myself, but I don't know if like the baby is like lower or my stomach has just changed. But last time, if I look at my notes, I was 34 and three quarters of an inch and I just weighed myself and it was like 34 and a half inches. So I'm not really sure what that's about. Maybe I had just eaten the last time. I don't know. But um, yeah, so we'll just probably kind of scratch that number this time and see what it is the next week. But yeah, that's all that's really going on. I um, tr am trying to schedule our ultrasound, our 20 week ultrasound, which is like three weeks away. And since we're out of town, it's a little more complicated with my midwife having to send over the um, request and trying to find somewhere that is covered through insurance and all that, which we're in a really small town. So it, it's not like there's somewhere right around here. We have to drive kind of a ways to get to an ultrasound place, and hopefully this place is okay. Um, we will find out the gender of the baby, and I'm not quite sure what we're gonna do yet. We kind of, Jeremy really wants it to be like a surprise. He doesn't want to find out in the office. He wants them to like write it on a paper, put it in an envelope, and kind of you know do it as a family, which I think would be cool. But I don't know. We're just in a small town. I don't have much like faith in these people that I, w I need to see it for myself, I guess is what I'm saying. Like if someone were to tell me you're having a girl, I just really would not believe it. So we haven't really decided what we're going to do about that. If we're going to find out in the office or um, do it kind of privately as a family, I'm not really sure yet. But we'll keep you guys updated as we decide. It'll probably be like the day before that we actually decide what we're going to do. But we're very excited to find out the gender. We did do the red cabbage test, like the gender prediction test and the baking soda test. Um, I will put links below. Um, I don't know. <laughs> and you guys can tell me what you think if it's a boy or a girl. Obviously, 
it's not 100% or anything. We just did it for fun. I've seen lots of people do it and it was just for fun. So I'll link those below if you guys want to check those out. And yeah, I think that's all I have to update on. I will insert a belly shot at the end and let me know if you guys have any questions or comments and we'll see you guys next week at 18 weeks. Bye.